And tonight, Nigerians, we are here. And we are here, Gitibam, for grand. No shaking. Because of time, the first thing we are going to do is what we call traditional wedding in Nigeria. We just want to let our brothers and sisters in Jamaica the way we do marry in Nigeria. We don't joke with marriage. That is why we don't joke with our wives, we don't joke with our husband. Tonight you are going to see the little process. Though we assume that the first step, the second step is over. We are going direct to the final stage. What we call traditional wedding in Nigeria. Hello. And we now welcome DJ. Are you ready? The parents of the bride are already here, seated. Because marriage in Nigeria is not for one person. It's not for the parents of the groom only. It's both family, both parents of the groom and parents of the world bride. That is how we marry in Nigeria. One man cannot get up in the morning and say, I am going to marry. Who are you? You must go with your parents. You must go with your kinsmen. You must go with what we call Omona. Hello. So watch out what is going to happen here now. The parents of the bride, they are here already. The parents of the groom, they are here present. Now DJ, give us music. We welcome the groom will come in first and get seated. DJ music. Are you there? Thank you very much. You can see both parents doing what they're supposed to do. That is greeting in our culture. The groom, please. Your boy in front, your boy in front. Thank you and the kids that are coming with the groom. Thank you. Thank you very much. Check body now. Thank you. Yes, so thank you. Nice to wear your parents here. And get seated. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, DJ. Thank you. We just want to come join it. Um um before we go further, we also assume, like I said before, that the first step. The second step, we have concluded that. That is what we call a traditional rite. Both yam, beer, mortar, hot drink, cola nut, bag of rice, bag of salt, tin of kerosene, tomato, pomade, and so on. We assume that we have collected all those things. Hello. Hello! But tonight, the woman must do one thing, the kinsman must do something significant. Where is your gallon of wine to your in-law? Thank you very much. This representing palm wine in our culture, which is very, very important. We cannot, and you cannot, never, you go to marry with that pan wine. Thank you very much. The in-law, they have received that. Now, DJ, get ready. We want to welcome the, the bride and the, what we call in our area, Ashebi. 
And they are coming. Well, thank you very much. I had that voice here. They're in Taraj. They are coming. Thank you. DJ, music. Yes, sir. I can see it. Everybody, they wait. Give her a cup of wine to go and look for that man that she is mad of. That is what we call a searching of husband. If she happens to return with another man, there is trouble. <laughs> and I hand over the microphone to the father of the bride to do that uh, program. Over to you. Adam Oma. Uh, my beautiful daughter, go and show us the man you said that wants to marry you. We have not seen him. Thank you very much. The young lady will now move to go and look for that man. The man that has been giving her sleepless night. The honey, the darling, the sugar. Everything in her tea, she will show us this night. Oh, yeah, let's go. Music, DJ music. What is going to happen here? The young man will now consume the drink, signifying that he has accepted to marry a young lady. If he didn't consume that drink, another trouble, another wahala. And he will put some amount of dollar inside the cup. Amount of dollar, reasonable one. Thank you very much. Are you there? They will now turn back to the parents of the bride for blessing, which is the most important thing in traditional wedding. Thank you very much, DJ. This is go ahead. Thank you, thank you very much. In our culture, this is significant. You can't do without it. Your parents must bless you so that it shall be well with you. My son, you are welcome to my family. And I am sure my daughter is welcome to your family. Today you have become my son and my daughter has become your partner for life. But you are a custodian. Your father is the one that I know. I will bless you. 
I bless you, my son. I bless you, my daughter. You will have children. You will have male children and female children. Prosperity will follow you. Our lineage will prosper. Amen. Now, take my daughter to her new home and show her her mother and her father. Thank you very much. And now, the groom will now take beautiful wife to his own parents for another blessing. And after that, will now dance, dance, and dance, and celebrate them. If you have money, you have gift, you have whatever, you cannot give to them. Please. My son, wake up. My daughter, wake up. Mommy, see the bride. You have eyes. I'm happy to welcome you in our family. You are going to have children. Remember, after some time now, we will, uh, we will retire. And you are going to take up the family. Remember, do not do anything that will tarnish the image of our family. Tell your children, sell when they come. You are going to get male children, you are going to get female children in abundance. <laughs> by this time next year, by this time next year, I, will, I want to have a grandchild of one year one year and two months all right god has blessed you to come to this family we are going to take care of you look at your husband just face yourself this is the apple of your eyes all right take good care of her when you get back to the city all right if anything happens your mother is here all right so we will take care of all of you. All right? Go and enjoy your day. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you very much. Um, the bride and the bridegroom just stand here, just for a minute before the music. One of the significant things you should understand here today is this. When you pass all this process in our culture, it will be difficult for you to divorce. You understand what I'm saying? When you pay heavily to marry a wife or to marry your wife, you will find it difficult to let her go. That is our culture. That is why when you are leaving your parents' house as a woman, they will tell you to look very well before you leave. And that is why they give you that drink to go and bring who is your husband. If you do that, it's safe. Miss it. Let us.
That was just a tip of the iceberg.